Um, we're going to check this one out. This is called Yato Suki Beretta. Or Yato Suki Beretta. I don't know, dude. I couldn't tell you. Oh. 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 Um, you can stop pretending that you can't see me. I've never seen myself so clearly before, and this is quite stranger for someone who doesn't quite strange for someone who doesn't exist, don't you think so? Come on. I'm Kagitoko and I'm worried. More precisely, one story. It bothers me. At first there was nothing like that, and then I wanted to come up with a similar story, and this is where my anxiety began. Did you like it that much? There must be no flaws in it. Or is there some? That's why you want to invent your own to correct these flaws? What is she talking about? Flaws? That story is a little bit unusual and even strange. It is difficult to separate the advantage, the advantages and disadvantages. Something can be both this and that simultaneously. Hmm, I see. Or maybe the main flaw in that story is that it is not yours? No, it's not like that. The similarity of my story will not be reduced to imitation. There will be originality in it. Ooh, hmm. Do you think those who don't know the original story will be able to appreciate it? And in general, is it for you and for others? Others? What about others? This will be my story. Looking from the outside sometimes changes things unrecognizable. These eyes from the darkness, just by its presence, can bring everything to naught. You just have to notice them or even just imagine. What with this eyes? There is no one here except us. Um, you're the only one here. Oh, whoa. This is weird. Oh. Hmm. Strange metal thing. On one side it's rounded into the ring, and on the other there are jagged protrusions. This is a simple key. Simple keys don't appear out of nowhere. This shouldn't happen in my story. Okay, let's just have a key. There's the door. It's just a door. It seems that the key should fit. Wait. Do you think there's another door here? Even if there is. The key disappeared as soon as it was placed in the keyhole. This shouldn't have happened. Everything should be different. Not that way. Not in butter chicken. Hmm. Huh? Sugar cube. Why am I scared of eyes in the dark? Without a doubt, they see everything. Both me and what's inside me. I can only see eyes in the dark. What's this? Um, a sugar cube. You just said it. Didn't you hear? It was as if someone was talking about eyes. Maybe you heard it wrong. Or is it the habit of complicating everything that makes itself felt? I don't have that kind of habit. She went where her eyes led. Did you hear something again? Seems you're not joking. Why would I make this up? This is your story, didn't you forget? <gasps> oh, fuck. Is that me? Her eyes looked at absolute opposites, trying to find something in common between them. You mean Nikki is you? What do you think this is for? Looks like a failed attempt. Attempt? Sometimes heroes and stories meet such ones. They persistently strive for something, but no matter what they did, they were haunted by failure after failure. They seem to be telling the hero that nothing will work out for him. After all, they didn't succeed, even though they tried. Maybe it's her voice you hear? Of course not. She doesn't have a mouth, only an eye. Giant eyeball thing. Yeah, I don't want to touch that thing. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, I don't like this thing. <gasps> oh, there's many of them. Oh, God. Oh. In the magnifying glass, she saw a hundred eyes that looked like looked at the giant. What? Oh my god. Her gaze left burns on the skin on which bubbles grew, and as they grew, tiny pupils appeared, so the whole body was covered with eyes with the same burning gaze. 
Oh, fudge. Oh, no. I don't like them. Teeth. She was the sweetest. There was no one sweeter. The sweetest sweetness filled her from within with pulsating flow. Once a droplet of sweet appeared from a small cut and having tasted a drop, she couldn't hold back any longer and drank all the sweetness for herself. It looks like the voice is coming from there. And you still don't hear anything? Just gnashing of teeth. This reminds me of a story about a door that ate the keys and those who tried to open it. It was afraid to let anyone in and that's why they ate them all. Hmm. And then the door was tormented by questions. Why did it why did it do it? But for the answer, someone would need to enter the door. Teeth door. No, no, nothing like it. It just ate everyone and that's all. Okay, nothing. I'm not trying to deal with finger monsters. This sucks. Oh my god. Okay, that's what happens if they touch you then, huh? Start from the beginning. This thing is gross. <gasps> Fuck you. Never notice a 13 tattoo? I have a couple 13s actually. What's the inspiration? Just a lucky number. I've got quite a uh, quite a few. Do you have the key? I don't understand. Try going through the back door. I'm always trying to go through the back door. Fugazi thing? Ah, oh, no. Fugazi rules though. Oh. Don't touch me. Oh. She wanted to look at herself from the different view with the eyes from a jar of strange smelling liquid. Yeah, right. Just try not to look like they might change your intention. Can they? What? Huh? The language, the, like, translation is, like, I mean, it's translated, but it's not that great, to be honest. It doesn't really make sense of what they're saying at all. What game is this? This is called Yado Suki Baretta. Saki Baretta, or something like that. But, um, I got tagged about it by somebody because it was recently translated. Okay, what am I supposed to do? Hmm. Okay, just touch me then. I don't care. Don't care. This is fine. Exactly. Oh. Oh, now you give me the key. Thanks. Nice. Yeah, thank you, Rickat. Oh. Oh, come on. Kirby does have some wild mini games, huh? This is just normal Kirby. Fuck you, come on, what am I supposed to do? Um. They won't last long. In your words, it's like a staring contest. Dude. I just want to get out of this bitch. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> okay. Take that key. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Take that key. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yep. Nothing wrong here. Whoa. Who? Strange tongue. Um, they say that the key to understanding is the ability to listen. 
Wait, so you can hear it now? I guess anyone could hear it this close. Once an evil tongues decide to lick the sufferer and taste of flavored yearning made their fingertips numb. What? Seems like it's hearing what's said isn't enough. Something's bound to slip through. Hmm. Oh, I can walk anywhere. Desire for bittersweet pain sparkles with the drop of saliva. Childish fear from the depths give the sticky fingers the will. Headless boy is in a plate, covered in pink suffering. He's like a magnet for a girl with a knife. Others don't cry for things like that. Girl is floating in pink suffering and sleepy robe. Merges from deep waters, weaving dreams deftly. Bro, huh? Time has come. <clears throat> Everyone who decided to make up the story must be prepared for this moment. When all you need is to clench your fingers into a fist and stop wag your tongue. When the only thing required is to ask yourself, is everything correct? Was it intended to be this way? Isn't it better to stop and give up this idea? And finally, what is this all about? What is this story about? Hmm. I don't understand a thing. It seems like this is, if one who came up with the story cannot say what it is about, whoever here, it will not be able to, at best, their guesses will be nothing in common with the initial idea, and at worst, there will be its opposite. Everything is just like that. Neither attractive images nor charming descriptions won't fix it if the person who came up with the story can't ask this question. Huh? And I'm asking, can you do it? Can you ask yourself what your story is about? Seems this key cannot be obtained until it hears what the story is about. Heard and heard now, doesn't it? Maybe this should be written. I think this is a puzzle where I'm supposed to probably discern something based on all of these guys. That's my guess. Oh, maybe not, because I can't. They won't let me read anything now. Key. Give me key. Who? What is the story about? Me. I don't understand. Uh, key Body Horror Give me a clue These are cool creatures, though. What is this all about? What is this story about? Keys. I don't know. I, what is... Me? I did try me. No luck. Hmm... Maybe it's the question. Hmm. Myself? I repeat this over and over again. I think that's what it wants. A question. It's already fed up with answers. Myself. Let's assume that you guessed it yourself. What is the story about? 
Oh. All that remains is to find the answer. Huh? What the fuck? What? Huh? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. <gasps> ah! Wow. Okay. Hmm. Oh, it just loops. Three. Many would think that since you don't have a mouth that you can't talk, not just here. It's funny how it turns out you see with your own uh, eyes and those these same eyes deceive you. You show something to others believing that they see everything the same way as you, but in their eyes you meet only misunderstanding. The eyes speak, sometimes only they can speak, without hiding anything. One glance is enough to change everything, and when she understands this, she will become one of us. You can close your eyes and go into the darkness, but how can it help something that you can call your own? How can it help something that you can call your own appear? The eyes steal everything they see, and only here, where there is nothing else, something your own could appear. But wouldn't that be a spawn of darkness? I have returned, and this time with pizza, let's go. Funny joke, I'll remember it. Um, the key to understanding has already been found. Oh, there's the door. I'm gonna get a pizza soon? Hell yeah, dude, you deserve that. I want a pizza too, man. Hmm. I haven't quite figured out what's going on, you know? I can see through walls like that in the story. Even if it is a metal cage, it's still a wall because you can't get through it. Huh. It's a cool environment. I hate pizza. Walk in one direction without turning and what you see will remain behind. And But why then it's before my eyes again? One direction cannot mean one arrival point. Huh? Pizza's overrated? That's crazy. Hmm, I got lost, even knowing and seeing everything in advance. Why did it seem to me as something impossible? Raycat is a oh Raycat is over uh rated. True. Wait, I can't go that way? Oh shit. I'll go this way. Ah! What is that? Gygus. Gygus up in here. Looks tempting. Strange rattling, rotating thing. There's something about it. And my story isn't so tempting anymore? I saw it crisp and clear. How would it be? But now, I will find you both. I will definitely finish it. You can get a little distracted and the clarity of what needs to be done will come back. For some, the cage is a way to protect themselves. For others, it's something that you need uh, from what you definitely need to find a way out but for all it's the same in one way you can see what is on the other side I'll leave my porch lid on yeah me too oh shit now where are we oh they're hanging from the trees aren't they this is so vague yeah and it's like poor it's like translated too, kind of roughly so have a pizza to share with you and blow your mind and warm your heart. <gasps> That's so nice. Do I just keep looping in here? Oh. Oh! Okay. They're awake. 
They're good. Hmm. Okay. Not the beets, it's more the cheese. Cheese is strange to you. That's interesting. Fair enough. I feel like this is where I should be, but I don't... I don't really have a confirmation, do I? Flavor of cheese is a flavor that makes me believe in God. That's fair. Deliciousness, honestly, is probably the closest relationship with the creator I have. <laughs> oh, God. Um, oh, yes. This guy. Yeah, cool. Um, that's not her in the trees, is it? No, she hasn't been here yet. But not everyone will be able to avoid this place unless she remained in tomorrow day. How is that? One remained in the past day and she's forgotten. Another in tomorrow and she occupies all thoughts. I think I understand. Yesterday can be remembered and returned, but tomorrow may not appear at all. What has not yet arrived is extremely rarely one's own, which makes it even less possible. It's interesting until it appears before your eyes. Who? Will she become the same as all of you? No, I doubt. Like with a hundred figure fingers or with large tongue that doesn't fit in mouth, I think she liked them. Or maybe she'll remain the same. Hmm. I, who am I? Am I just like some form of some kind of perception? Am I just perceiving this character now? I don't understand. Oh. I thought that you disappeared, but I could still feel the presence of someone nearby. Um, I don't think I can be anywhere far from you. And by the way, that red key also is also disappeared. Uh-oh. I think I know where it is. It's in the trees? Okay. Oh. Is it over? Yep. <laughs> oh, God. It says unable to find file data map eight RV data two, so I guess that's it. Pretty good game. Gonna gonna just you know just gonna. That's it. 